All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Bunga Stray Dogs season five, episode eleven, the finale of the season. Um, I'm very much looking forward to this episode. It's interesting that uh, apparently manga readers have no idea what's going to happen in this episode, which is pretty damn cool, but kind of possibly scary as well, considering that it's going to likely be anime-only content, or maybe it's just content that the author's like, hey, I haven't drawn this yet, but this is what we should do. I don't know if that's how it would work, but whew, I'm excited for this episode. Everybody got clapped up last episode. Dazai got shot in the head. Uh, no idea how he's going to survive this, but uh, I'm very excited to see if he does. <laughs> anyway, guys, if you're new to the channel, please like the video and subscribe to the channel if you're new. Thank you guys so much for the support on Mungo Stray Dogs this season. I'll see you all in season six, probably like four years from now. Um, so let's get right into this episode right now. I think I know what she might do here. I think maybe she jumps off and like grabs the table. That's one way to give it another jerk of energy. I don't know. That'd be crazy though. Some fucking Michelin, but Mission Impossible shit going on right here. Oh shit, bro! They've already got. They've already been shot off. Oh my god, what's gonna happen? Hello? Anyone? After she's been bit? Bruh. Just a lack of weight. Oh my god, she is. She's gonna do it. Do you weigh more than that desk? Bro. She has to land on the desk. Oh my god, my legs. Oh shit. Bro, you better get your powers back quick. Oh shit. Counter attack. What? What? He sliced his neck. Wait, no, his chest. His wrist. What's the weakness? What's the weakness? Again? Brother, I'm freaking out. It's only the shoulder, though. It's not so bad. Oh, he's got the sword. Oh, he's using the sword. Oh, my God. That's fucking hard. Did it work? Please, God, did it work? And this bitch walked out. Where the fuck is this? What? Nah, I'm not going to be ready for every single thing that happens in this episode. I need to sit tight. Correct. <laughs> this is for the audience. Appreciate that. Using them? Who are they? Vampires? Oh, damn. Okay. That was easy. You should probably inject yourself with that as soon as possible. What is this? Where'd all that blood come from? Oh, okay. Yeah, I remember. Since that man, who? See, now Theodore thinks he's actually dead. There's nothing coming back from this. Dazai has the upper hand. Oh shit, he's out. Oh, damn. Better be ready for this shit, bro. Um, what happened? Oh, what happened? Oh! Oh, shit! What? <gasps> Bram! Oh! Daza, you bitch! Your leg! Damn. How? Nah. How does I? Is he up? Oh, what? Oh, yeah, Bram. Oh, that's fucking cool. Hey, he's got his full body back. Damn. Kneeling for her. 
<laughs> That's fucking sick, dude. Okay, what about the big missiles? Oh, just... Oh my god, they were close. Ooh. Bro, I have saved the fucking planet, dude. Holy shit. What is he... Was that a smelling salt? Oh no, he's holding his nose. <laughs> oh, damn, Rampo's out. He just left that shit to fate? Daza had trust in everyone. Oh! <laughs> Theodore's done for. Yeah, how do you explain that? <laughs> He's back! Yes, bro! Oh my god. Contact lenses? Fuck off! Oh. Where you get vampire contact lenses that cover your whole eye? Oh my god, that's gotta hurt. Is he gonna kill him? He's gonna do it. Oh my god, this is his friend. The most flawless strike of my life. Oh no. Oh, he did it though. Fuck! What is that? Book? Does this have the page in it? Oh, what? What is happening? What? What's he letting out of there? Oh, he glued vampire teeth in? How'd he get this man to do this? What? Bro, Chuya's built different. We used to do this all the time. <laughs> Fear Feardog got fucked on this, not gonna lie. Oh my god. He was like 20 steps ahead. What's he gonna do? Have the vampire kill him? Does that mean the vampire's gonna kill himself as well? This is a dude, man. Oh wow. Oh wow. What did, what did you just say? So that random pilot got to die too? Why don't you just shoot him in the head? <laughs> Damn. Oh, okay. Oh. Okay. So as to prevent incidents like today's. Wow. Rid the world of war. Okay, that was his goal. Rid the world of war by blowing everything up? Okay. I guess one united enemy, I suppose. So he stopped a world war? Oh, shit. Is that anemic jackass? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking love you, yeah. Can we can we confirm a body, please? We're not doing this shit again. I don't care if that's his arm, bro. It's Theodore. Also, did does I actually inject himself? Has he got an antidote? He's holding the antidote. Okay. This has been a long half an hour. Nah, they didn't- they'd get whole countries involved. That's- that's a nice... hope. I like that. That's a pretty cool goal. He went about it in an odd way, but... If I read- if I read it correctly, he stopped a world war. Or well, maybe the world war was was him. That was what was. I don't know. I I, I, don't, I don't really understand it. <laughs> it's gonna be a long time till anything like this happens, if it happens. Oh, 
人類軍の総帥がワンオーダーを使用すれば各国は国家主権の根幹を喪失する全ての軍が人類軍帰化となれば戦争は起こらない I mean yeah makes sense そのためのテロ計画が戦争はなくなる永久に現地はそれは無理筋だ I don't know though like people have always fought in war people humans just do violence for the sake of it yeah. Why? Oh, what? Oh, what? 500 lives? Damn. Yeah, so okay, so it definitely wasn't him. He knew this shit was gonna happen. That's not a bad deal. Not gonna lie. It sucks to be one of the 500, but it's not a bad deal. Damn. Bro, the story's done a complete 180 on this man's motivation. Oh, this really sucks having to kill his friend now. Like 500 compared to 210 million. One man compared to the detective agency. Ah, oh, man. Oh, shit. Probably none. Nope. He's so calm. Oh, God. I'm tearing up. Is he not going to do it? Oh, I figured he wouldn't. Bitch! Oh my god! That's messed up. So he told her that whole plan. Wow. Fuck, man! Now I'm not actually sure if Aya did, I mean Aya did save the planet, but like, this was all part of his plan. So, oh god, this is, this is a complicated episode considering it's apparently anime only. Oh, that sucks though, man. No, Aya has her knight, that's pretty cool. Rampo. Oh, Oh, that, that hurt as well. Fucking destroy it. He looks fucking dead inside, man. He can't even bring himself to destroy it. Oh my god. Oh shit, two hours later. Bro, what? <laughs> Bitch, who the... What is that? Nah, this is ridiculous. What is going on? Oh my god, he's got armor. That looks fucking sick. Who are you? What the? Right, so that was Bongo Stray Dog Season 5, Episode 11. Nice catch my breath. What it, what it, what are the manga only fans or what do the manga fans think of that episode because to me that was fucking amazing but like did it make sense was it too much was like too much resolved also what the hell is this character at the end I don't know I haven't I don't know what to think everything got solved they didn't use the page part of me was thinking that they might use the page to fix things but that would have been too simple kind of but the way they explained Dazai death, that was that was pretty cool. <laughs> Chuya, interesting. That just everything that happened there. It makes sense. <laughs> but like, bro. Um Aya was a real one. Oh, Prez, I feel so bad for President. Oh, Fukuzawa. That was so that sucks. I liked the 
motivation behind the plan. I liked finding out what the plan was. Um, yeah, damn, he was. I mean, he he was never really that bad, even though the story played him out to be until the the very last moment. He had good intention, but it was like it was kind of a fleeting dream. Was it going to happen so soon? I don't know. God damn, man. That was a fucking good episode. And then this this character that shows up, this godlike character that shows up at the end of the episode. To be continued, sure. Yeah, when I'm when I'm 80. Um God damn. Overall, I think it was a fantastic episode. Let me know what you guys think. Because I really knew it. I really need to know what the manga fans think of this. Also, what was the scene that because you guys said there was like one more scene that was manga content before? It was just no idea what's going to happen. Let me know what the scene was um, that kind of took place in this episode. Presumably, it's the Aya, like, kicking, jumping on the table. I don't know. Let me know. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching this series along with me this season. I really appreciate the support. Stick around for whenever season six comes out or another movie or whatever the hell's going to happen next. Um, but yeah, have a nice rest of your day and peace out, guys.